president. Yes, I would. All right, would you please make your amendment? Yes, sir. My name is James Merritt. I'm a messenger from Cross Point Church in Duluth, Georgia. Mr. President, I'd like to amend the motion, and if I get a second, I'd like to speak to it. I would move that we delete paragraph six, which reads, whereas we recognize the Confederate battle flag serves for some, not as a symbol of hatred, bigotry, and racism, but as a memorial to their loved ones who died in the Civil War and an emblem to honor their loved ones' valor. And then I would like to move that reword, re, reword paragraph 12 to read as follows. Resolved that we call our brothers and sisters in Christ to discontinue the display of the Confederate battle flag as a sign of solidarity of the whole body of Christ, including our African-American brothers and sisters. All right, the amendment has been offered, and if you have a copy of that amendment, would you be sure that we receive a copy immediately? Yes, sir. All right, you may be able to speak to your amendment, Dr. Merritt, so go right ahead. My fellow Southern Baptists, I'm not speaking to you today just as a pastor of a church. I am the great-great-grandson of two men who fought in the Confederate Army. One is buried in a Confederate cemetery in Lynchburg, Virginia. One fought in the battle of my hometown, Atlanta, Georgia. I cannot undo what they fought for, but they cannot undo what I wish they had done and what I pray we will do today. Make no mistake, this is a seminal moment in our convention. I believe that God has brought the SBC to both the kingdom and our culture for such a time as this. What we do today with this issue will reverberate through this nation, not just today, but I believe a hundred years from now. This is not a matter of political correctness. It is a matter of spiritual conviction and biblical compassion. We have a golden opportunity to say to every person of every race, ethnicity and nationality. The Southern Baptists are not a people of any flag. We march under the banner of the cross of Jesus and the grace of God. Today, we can say loudly and clearly to a world filled with racial strife and division, that Southern Baptists are not in the business of building barriers and burning bridges. We're about building bridges and tearing down barriers. So I close with this. There is one thing no one can deny. This flag is a stumbling block to many African-American souls to our witness. And I rise to say that all the Confederate flags in the world are not worth one soul of any race. So my fellow Southern Baptists who I love with all of my heart, and thank God that I will die a Southern Baptist, I ask you to join me as one to support both this amendment and this resolution. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. Merritt. Dr. Rummage, would your committee like to speak toward that amendment?